STS-97 was a Space Shuttle mission to the International Space Station flown by Space Shuttle Endeavour. The crew installed the first set of solar arrays to the ISS, prepared a docking port for arrival of the Destiny Laboratory module, and delivered supplies for the station's crew. Crew Spacewalks Tanner and Noriega, EVA-1 EVA-1 start, 3 December 2000–1835 Coordinated Universal Time EVA-1 end, 4 December 2000–208 Coordinated Universal Time Duration, 7 hours, 33 minutes Tanner and Noriega, EVA-2 EVA 2 start, 5 December 2000 to 1721 Coordinated Universal Time. EVA 2 end, 5 December 2000 to 2358 Coordinated Universal Time. Duration, 6 hours, 37 minutes. Tanner and Noriega, EVA 3. EVA 3 start, 7 December 2000 to 1613 Coordinated Universal Time. EVA 3 end, the 7th of December 2000 to 2123 Coordinated Universal Time. Duration: 5 hours 10 minutes. Topic: Mission highlights. During the 11-day mission, the primary objective was completed, which was to deliver and connect the first set of U.S.-provided solar arrays to the International Space Station. The astronauts completed three spacewalks, during which they prepared a docking port for arrival of the Destiny Laboratory module, installed floating potential probes to measure electrical potential surrounding the station, installed a camera cable outside the Unity module, and transferred supplies, equipment, and refuse between Endeavour and the station. On flight day three, Commander Brent Jett linked Endeavour to the ISS while 230 statute miles above northeast Kazakhstan. The successful checkout of the Extravehicular Mobility Units EMUs, the Simplified Aid for EVA Rescue safer Units, the Canadarm RMS, the Orbiter Space Vision System OSVS, and the Orbiter Docking System ODS were all completed nominally. Also, the ODS centerline camera was installed with no misalignment noted. From inside Endeavour, Canadian mission specialist Mark Garneau used the Canadarm to remove the P 6 truss from the payload bay, maneuvering it into an overnight park position to warm its components. Mission specialists Joseph Tanner and Carlos Noriega moved through Endeavour's docking tunnel and opened the hatch to the ISS docking port to leave supplies and computer hardware on the doorstep of the station. On flight day 4, the Expedition 1 commander William Shepard, pilot Yuri Gidzenko and flight engineer Sergei Krikalev, entered the Unity module for the first time and retrieved the items left for them. At 9.36 Eastern Standard Time on 8 December 2000 the crew paid the first visit to the Expedition 1 crew residing in the space station. Until then the shuttle and the station had kept one hatch closed to maintain respective atmospheric pressures, allowing the shuttle crew to conduct their spacewalks and mission goals. After a welcome ceremony and briefing, the eight spacefarers conducted structural tests of the station and its solar arrays, transferred equipment, supplies and refuse back and forth between the spacecraft, and checked out the television camera cable installed by Tanner and Noriega for the upcoming mission. On the 9th of December 2000, the two crews completed final transfers of supplies to the station and other items being returned to Earth. The Endeavour crew bade farewell to the Expedition 1 crew at 10.51 Eastern Standard Time and closed the hatches between the spacecraft. After being docked together for 6 days, 23 hours and 13 minutes, Endeavour undocked from the station at 14.13 Eastern Standard Time. Piloted by Michael Bloomfield, it then made an hour-long, tail-first circle of the station. The undocking took place 235 statute miles above the border of Kazakhstan and China. 
The final separation burn took place near the northeast coast of South America. STS 97 was the 15th flight of Endeavour and the 101st Space Shuttle mission. <laughs> Wake up calls NASA began a tradition of playing music to astronauts during the Gemini program, which was first used to wake up a flight crew during Apollo 15. Each track is specially chosen, often by their families, and usually has a special meaning to an individual member of the crew, or is applicable to their daily activities. Images. <laughs> 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 See also List of human spaceflights List of International Space Station spacewalks List of Space Shuttle missions List of spacewalks and moonwalks 1965–1999 Outline of space science <laughs>